remember those things. Take this. Use it if you have to. Sit down. Over there. You, right here. Sit. Now. Arrêtez, bande de con! C'est mon bateau! Stop! Ferme-la, ou je te mets mon poing dans la gueule! Olsen! Come here! Which one of you is gonna tell me about this Manchurian goo? Just talking. You wanna talk? Keep the volume down. I'm just gonna say it. Fliss has gotta be in on this. She and these guys, they travel in the same waters. She's a captain and they barely laid a hand on her? I bet you told them about the Manchurian gold. They're in cahoots. Are you out of your mind? How did you come up with this bullshit? How fucking dare you, you overprivileged asshole? You're all in this together. This is a trap, and you set us up. Yeah, asshole. Put a cork in it. about this storm you can give us? It's a little bit hairy out here. Over. Big storm coming in from the east. Gotta hit you pretty hard, but should pass through your coordinates within an hour. You sound a little stressed, Duke. Please let me know if you need assistance. Not used to a little weather freaking you out. <laughs> yeah. Uh, okay. A-OK -okay out here. We can handle a couple of puffs and drops of rain. Uh, thanks for the info. We'll see you for drinks back on shore in a couple of days.
I guess. Anyone know about Brad? Is he hiding somewhere? Huh? Brad said he was hiding under the bunk beds. We can't leave him down there. He could drown. We need to get him out of there. He's not safe. Brad, buddy, come out! Move. Well, you seem to have already suffered a casualty. That was a bold move. Not smart, but bold. <sighs> Kind-hearted creature I am, I'd like to offer you some forewarning of what's to come. Tempted? <laughs> okay then, we will turn to the Bard for inspiration. The Merchant of Venice, Act 2, Scene 7. The Prince of Morocco pulls a scroll from the eye of a skull and reads, All that glisters is not gold. Often have you heard that told. Anyway, now that you've reached a point of significant distress, I presume you're eager to get back to your story, but here's a thing. Everything may not be entirely as it seems. <sighs> Probably shouldn't have said that.
du cimetière. J'espère qu'on est les seuls ici. Oh là Au balai Place is a floating death trap. not sign up for a trip to Creep Town. now. fucking place. It has to have something to do with the Manchurian gold. We're not far from those coordinates. Anyone else creep the fuck out by this ship? Maybe this is the ship that was carrying the gold. Guess it's a possibility. We can't just sit around. We need a plan. Let's get back to our boat, get the hell away from here, and never step foot off dry land again. How's that for a plan? I saw one of the goons take something out of the boat. Distributor cap. Makes the engine work. The Duke of Milan is a floating brick without it. We need to get it back. While those guys are out panning for Manchurian gold or whatever they think they're gonna find on this floating coffin, we gotta take advantage and look around for a way out of here. Fliss? I just wanted to say that, um, I might have gotten things kind of wrong back there. Uh, excuse me? I may have kind of prematurely come to the conclusion that maybe, you know, you're working some kind of side deal with these guys, or whatever. But I, I mean, obviously that's not true. They're being just as bad to you as they are to us, so, yeah. Allow me to translate. He's saying that he's sorry. Well, I... Hmm. Well, your apology is kinda accepted. Cool. Cool. What do you 
think this ship was? This guy, Miller? Guy seemed pretty spooked. This is very strange. How are you doing? I really don't want to know what these guys are going to do with us. I wonder why they all left it behind. Hey. I found this letter that was never sent. Okay. Well, it said there were rumors about figures roaming around the cargo. Figures? You want to be more specific? Look, I'm not really sure what he meant. All I know is that I just get this really creepy feeling like something terrible happened here. Something is wrong. I don't like it. I don't like a single thing about this place. Not at all. I just wish I knew what the fishermen were planning. Back on the Duke, I overheard them talking about the Manchurian gold. <laughs> I really don't think they had any of this planned until the gold caught their attention. We need to watch them closely. This could go from bad to worse if they don't find what they're looking for. So, what do we do? Look, we need to either find a way out of this room, or we need to be ready to make a move when those fishermen come back. Okay, well we're not gonna do anything from in here. We need to keep looking around and try to find a way out. Just be careful. been on a lot of ships and this <laughs> it barely qualifies it work that way je vais aller explorer la salle des machines Danny, tu fous les soutes les soutes t'es sérieux t'as vu l'endroit ça tombe en ruine Olson et j'ai pas les outils pour y arriver fais ce que fais ce que je te dis et c'est tout va te faire foutre quoi qu'est-ce que t'as dit rien trop du cul Arrêtez, arrêtez ça. Ta gueule, Junior. Tu restes ici et tu surveilles les prisonniers. Prisonniers On est en prison Charme. On sera bientôt riche si vous la fermez. Et si vous faites ce que je vous dis de faire. Il y a quelque chose qui cloche ici. Je sais pas, cet, cet endroit est bizarre. Olson, 
on tuait seulement les volets. Et là, on se retrouve coincé sur ce ratio de merde qui pue la mort. Et on a des prisonniers Ça va trop loin, tout ça. Vos gueules Fermez-la tous les deux. Je suis votre capitaine. Et je vous ordonne d'obéir à mes ordres. 